Hi folks, welcome to the 2022 Captain Fever Challenge. As you can see, once again, I am in absolute blizzard conditions. Uh, visibility right now, I'd say, is about, at best, 150, 125 meters. Um, I actually can't see the road from where I am right now. I'm snowed out of my regular firing range, so my friend let me come up to their property, which is easier access. Um, and we'll see how this goes. Um, should be interesting. Very cold, I can barely feel my fingers. And uh, I'll go over the rest of the details back in the house. So, general uh, rules here. Force of fire is 20 rounds. Five standing, five kneeling, five prone, and then five sitting in that order. Mandatory reloads in between each. Um, pretty good challenge. Let's see how we do. Hey everybody, we're back at the house now. Um, just quickly go over that run, go over the target. So you guys saw the score. Um, 
I counted 16 rounds on target. Uh, the 16th round may be a little tough. If you look closely, you'll find it though. Uh, it's right there in the you know right smack in the center where I have those four other hits. Um, I'm actually surprised I got that grouping out of it, but hey, guess I got lucky. Um, so that's in there. It's between two of the others, kind of keyhole a little bit. So um, hopefully the judge gives me that 16th. If not, oh well. Um, so there was that, and uh, this really put into light because of the weather conditions. Um, practice is everything, and I'm I'm very proud of how I did, um, especially considering the weather that I had while I was there. Um, I didn't even finish the other uh, division entries I was trying to record today because the weather started getting really bad, and uh, I had to get out of there before I got myself snowed in. So I only did this division three uh, entry so far, and hopefully I can get back up there in the next couple days and do the rest of my video. Um, so things I ran into, my ammunition didn't feed quite right. That's my fault. My reloads uh, weren't 100% within spec for this. That's one of the reasons I used them. Um, you know, I threw some black powder into them just to make things a little more exciting, which actually I'm surprised seems like it showed up pretty cool on the snow. Um, so we had that. Uh, reloads were very fiddly. That's just because of the weather conditions and because of my fingers. Um, I could not feel my fingers by the time I got out of there. It was it was getting really cold, so I wasn't having the easiest time reloading. Uh, definitely goes to show why lever-action rifles of that type were never really adopted militarily, at least officially. Um, awesome pack rifle. I don't think I would want to take that into winter conditions if I had to. Um, so we had that, and, uh, one of the other things I had tried in order to speed up my reloads was I tried, you know, sticking rounds between my fingers, hold on to them, that way I could access them easier, I've seen a lot of people do that. Uh, I'll tell you this, in the conditions that I had there where your hands are cold and you can't, you don't have much dexterity, that doesn't work. Um, I'm going to roll a reel here in a second of my first uh, practice attempt at this while I was up there and I tried doing that with the rounds between my fingers and the first shot that I let off I ended up dropping three of my five rounds that I had managed to keep in my fingers um, so that doesn't work in these conditions it just doesn't um, the rounds will slip right out so that's the scoop let me run the footage <laughs> 